Today we are going to discuss about National Program for Prevention and Control of Cancer, Diabetes, Cardiovascular Disease and Stroke Control. So um, as diabetes, cardiovascular diseases and stroke are more prevalent, so this program was launched in 2010 which was merged with the ongoing National Cancer Control Program to form the NPCDCS in 2011 to 2012. So, first it formed as um, NPDCS and it uh, merged with the Cancer Control Program in 2011 to 2012. Aim is to controlling the mod modifiable risk factors for cancer, cardiovascular diseases, diabetes, unhealthy diet, physical inactivity, harmful use of alcohol, promoting healthy lifestyles, early diagnosis and disease management. So, what are, uh, what are the components under NPCDCS? The main objectives of the program are prevention and control of the NCDs through behavior and lifestyle changes. So, uh, through behavior and lifestyle changes means uh, um, increased intake of healthy foods, uh, inhibiting the uptake of alcohol, uh, smoking like that, uh, regular physical activity, these all comes under prevention and control of common NCDs through behavior and lifestyle changes that is like uh, uh, cardiovascular diseases and diabetes through these changes. Pro provide early diagnosis and management of common non-communicable non diseases. So build capacity at various level of healthcare pro pre prevention, diagnosis and treatment that is primary, secondary and tertiary levels of the healthcare we should uh, uh, prevent the disease okay early diagnosis we should uh, see and we should provide uh, essential treatment to that train human resources with the public health setup like doctors paramedics and nursing staff to cope up with increasing burden of the ncds establish and developing develop capacity for palliative and rehabilitative care palliative care means end care so we should uh, um, develop the capacities for uh, rehabilitative care and palliative care. So the various approaches such as mass media, community education and interpersonal communication will be used for behavioral change focusing on the following messages. So we should use mass media like televisions, radios, for um, community education we should do, we should uh, tell them what is good, what is bad and we should educate the people in the community and interpersonal communications. So, uh, this will change the behavior, okay. So, first what we, what we should be conveying through this means uh, through this interpersonal uh, and behavioral changes we should convey increased intake of healthy foods, increased physical activities for at least 45 to 50 minutes and um, avoidance of tobacco and alcohol and stress management, okay. So, cancer components under the NPNC CDCS. So, objectives of program are primary prevention of cancers by health education, secondary prevention, early detection and diagnosis of cancer such as cancer of the cervix, mouth, breast and tobacco. Tertiary prevention is strengthening of the existing institutions. Tertiary means anyway there is involvement of the uh, health institution so existing institutions of comprehensive therapy including the palliative care so uh, end care also we should uh, strengthen in the institutions so the schemes under revised programs are regional cancer center institute oncology wing development scheme decentralized ngo scheme iec activities information education and control activities and central level and research and training okay so these we will be doing what are the objectives so we should primarily prevent the cancers by health education first stage is so who are risk uh, risk fact risk strategy what is the population strategy we should be dividing and we should um, educate them okay uh, we should educate them by telling what is uh, essential for uh, prevention of the cancers at the Early, early stages so and uh, at the primary level secondary prevention is early detection and diagnosis of common cancers that is cervical cancer through pap smear screening like that and uh, if uh, if anything um, uh, abnormality like uh, uh, bleeding per spotting or any itching or any pain we should uh, be asking them to come come to the clinic for uh, early, diag early diagnosis and early detection so that we prevent the progress of the disease. So breast and tobacco, tertiary prevention is um, institutions we should uh, be uh, having the therapy for even for palliative care. So um, the schemes under revised program are regional cancer center scheme, oncology wing development scheme, decentralized NGO scheme, IEC activities means information we should give information we should provide them education we should control the activity okay at central level we should research and train the health providers also so then
and we should re we should uh, engage them in the research and we should also train the uh, health providers regarding this tobacco control legislation the cigarettes and other tobacco products act 2003 the important provisions of the act are prohibition of smoking in public places main uh, smoking risk is uh, lung cancer along with the rcc renal uh, ca renal cell carcinoma so we should prohibit the smoking in public places and um, uh, if they do so we will uh, will uh, ask them to pay fine. We will make strict rules regarding this. Prohibition of direct and indirect advertisement of cigarette and other products. Okay. So that uh, it won't influence the people to take the cigarettes. And we should uh, inhibit the, we should prohibit the sale of the cigarette and other tobacco uh, products to a person below the age of 80 years. 18 years. Because they are not knowing what, what is right, what is wrong. And they, due to the stretches of education and so on, they try they try to uh, have cigarettes so we should prohibit the sale of cigarette and other tobacco products to the below the age of 18 years and we should prohibit the sale of the tobacco product products near the educational institutions so uh, there is a possibility of uh, consuming cigarettes by young uh, engaged uh, children because and engage people because uh, due to the stretches of ed stresses of education they may have chance in falling in the trap of tobacco so we should prohibit the sale of the tobacco near the educational institutions mandatory depiction of statutory warnings on the tobacco packs so uh, uh, every tobacco pack should contain warning signals what are the what will happen if you consume it and everything mandatory depiction of tar and nicotine contents along with the maximum permissible lim limits on the packs so you should uh, tell what is the maximum permissible le limit and um, what is the amount used and what is the tar de depiction there and everything should be uh, labeled on the pack so that the consumer will get alert and uh, he may try to avoid the cigarettes as soon as soon as possible after knowing the effects of it okay guys thank you this is about np ncds and hope uh, np cdcs okay uh, hope that you learned something from the video so np uh, cdcs is mainly due to uh, non-communicable diseases at uh, 2011 uh, they stroke for cardiovascular diseases one program is uh, uh, started and it merged with the cancer in 2011 to 2012 and it uh, uh, com combined known as NPCDCS main is uh, main aim is to uh, prevent the cancer and non-communicable diseases so uh, via primary uh, prevention secondary and tertiary and improving the training and uh, uh, more research on the cases and uh, we'll also ask them to prohibit the smoking and uh, uh, prohibit the smoking because smoking causes lung cancer and uh, uh, lung cancer and uh, uh, renal cell carcinoma and even uh, we'll uh, prohibit the uh, sale of the smoking near the uh, public institution for secondary prevention we are doing uh, cervical cancer uh, uh, screening cervical cancers and um, uh, lung cancers breast cancer everything so uh, and even we are uh, establishing palliative care uh, in the tertiary care centers for uh, uh, the patients who are at end uh, stage of the cancer so this is about npcdcs hope uh, you understood something about you have, you have found useful uh, this video if you like it share subscribe thank you thank you guys